Hi, Thingiverse fans. This is uh, John. I'm the inventor of this volumetric wind turbine. Um, it is currently unloaded and it's running about uh, 122 RPM. Oh, I'll check that. 213, 216. Two hundred sixteen RPM. Um, what I want to do is test this or low test this um, model, and the fan is providing the the fan at the end of the table providing the uh, uh, energy for the whole unit. Um, the wind fans being what they are, they are they don't blow an even consistent rate across the surface. So I took five measurements across the uh, diameter of the uh, turbine and uh, it turns out to be about 3.6 miles per hour. I used this handheld anemometer to measure the wind speed. At this point you can see the wind is blowing about one, eight miles per hour. Anyway, the, the uh, speed at the, across the surface of that Wind term is about 3.6 miles per hour. So I'm going to turn on the gram scale. And it's going to tear that weight uh, that's on it right now, and I want to load it up with a piece of monofilament and uh, another weight at the other end. And this pulling up on the monofilament. The rotation is pulling up on the monofilament and lifting weight off the scale. And so it's reading a negative a number here and that's the amount of work that the uh, wind turbine is doing currently. And it's going to slow down and it's currently loaded about 50 grams it's jumping all over the place because there is not a consistent um, because there's a little extra eccentricities in the in the pulley at the end of the the wind turbine. What this call is called is a prony brake uh, dynamometer. Uh, you have uh, you're you're measuring the RPM and you're measuring the load applied to an engine or a motor or or whatever. They were originally uh, developed uh, to test steam engines back when, the, when they were trying to find out what the actual uh, locomotives would pull and they needed to know. So it's now around about 97 RPM. And it's still holding about 50 grams. It looks like it's leveling out. 95, 94, 95. 95.4, so that's, that's about where it is. It's consistent at this point. And uh, if you want to take a look at the, I'll take this phone off the tripod here.